Hi, my name is Allison Piles, and today I'm going to talk to you about my journey choosing a language arts curriculum. I was really frustrated in my early homeschool years trying to find a curriculum that I felt met the needs of my kids and was all inclusive. I did not like having to piecemeal my language arts curriculum together. And so I came across a wonderful curriculum called the Logic of English. And the beautiful thing about this curriculum is it teaches you the rules to our language. And as a speech and language pathologist, I immediately just fell in love with this curriculum. I think that it probably was written by a speech therapist. So the, the curriculum will actually take you from age four all the way through high school. It's incredible and it allows you to be consistent in the work that you are doing. Our family has also chosen to um, educate classically. We do a lot of memorization and this fits in so lovely with the classical approach of education that we have chosen for our kids One as well. One of the well. biggest benefits that I find from Logic is English is that you can teach multiple students at the same time. So even though your students are at different levels, you teach the basic concept at a general level, and then you it teaches you and shows you systematically how to build upon that for each child in the level that they are at. Currently, my kids are nine and 11, and so at this point, I actually open up my lesson book and I go over the concepts with both children. But when it comes to spelling, there's two different spelling lists. One child will do the young, the the set first the early easier set and the other one will do B which is the more complex vocabulary also when it goes into grammar we teach basic grammar to both kids but then in the workbooks it provides more complex strategies for those older students but every day I'm sitting down with my kids and doing all of the work at the same time for each the nice lesson. things about logic of English is it provides you with a scope and sequence for the entire year and for every single lesson that you're going to go through. So it makes it really easy to report on. So if we look at the scope and sequence, for example, lesson 16, it talks about what sounds we're going to be exploring that day. What spelling rules are we gonna work on? What will we add to our spelling journal? What is the grammar? And then it also lists our spelling words for those students who are in A, B, or C. The workbook also gives you a section A, B, and C, so you're able to have your child do the work from that lesson according to their level in the program. One of the most fantastic things that I need to leave you with today is that the logic of English, especially for those younger ears, was really created for very active children. And I should have started off with this because it is key that each of the lessons goes through so systematically, it's super easy, but it actually includes activities to get your kids up out of their chairs and to be physically active and do fun things. And I do not like to cut and paste. I do not like have to do prep work. I don't like anything like that. It literally tells you like, have your kid jump across the room and do this or have the child hide this here or do that there. And it's really super, super fast and easy to make these lessons fun for those younger kids. One of the things that we use every day are grammar cards. We'll also use spelling rules and the phonogram cards that are included and game cards that have all the phonograms. Logic of English also gives you the opportunity if you want to do all of your work in print or in cursive. So there's lots of options for that as well and they go through it very systematically so your children can learn cursive along the way.